So she's saying they are sitting ducks. We could actually take a slay the whole house. See, look, that was me flat round there, then. Look, into third. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to Man Like Ricky, yeah? We are gonna go for a POV drive in a 500 and 10 brake horsepower BMW M3. Some of you that are new to the channel, you obviously watch me for the reaction videos, but I actually film cars for a living. We've got a lot of high performance cars around me. And uh, this car specifically is a car I've just bought from my company, LLF Game. So we're gonna park up, or should I say we're already parked up in the Tesco's. It's about 12 o'clock at night. I'm gonna do a little walk around, then we go for a little drive. So yeah, enjoy lads. Right, so as you can see, man's in big Tesco's, you know. 12 o'clock at night. I'm telling you, these night vlogs are coming back. So check it, Tanzanite Blue, F80 M3, are you mad? That is an absolute beaut. Come on, lads. I get offered so many M3s, but I only buy cars that I'll buy for myself. And this is one that I would buy for myself. And obviously this car is on the website, LLF Games, right now. You can win it for 11.99, yeah? Shit, loads of tickets have already gone, so you better be quick if you want a chance of winning this. I will be handing this over to the winner very, very soon. But this is a fully specced M3, so Tanzanite Blue. Do you know how rare this color is? It's not rare amongst individual colors, but yeah, this is a paid option from BMW. So, you, you know, the typical colors are like the, the whites, the blacks, the grays, you've got the Saka orange, the Marina Blues. This is very rare. When they come up for sale, they go quick. Aside from the color, this is fully specced. You can see we've got the M Performance exhaust. We've got loads of carbon fiber, carbon fiber diffuser, carbon fiber side blades. We've got Vorsteiner 20 inch alloys, 295 Michigan Pilot Sport 4S tires. Loads of rubber on the rear. You can see this is obviously not the owner that I bought it off, but that was the previous, previous owner. A little bit dirty right now, lads, but come on. Give me a break. Do you know what I mean? Absolute beaut. So it's lowered on IBAC springs, runs around 510 brake horsepower. Look at that, man. Are you mad? Bro. This has got me wanting another M3, man. No joke. You see the power dome on the bonnet? Got a three liter twin turbo, straight six engine. It's a boot mod flash, not sure on the actual tuner. But um, yeah, as I say, lowered on the eye batch rings. It's also had the crank pin kit. And this is also a fully specced M3. So when I say fully specced, I'm talking lane is Look, bro, you know how many of these M3s and M4s I've been out in? I never see these buttons. So look, you've got three different settings. When you go over a white line, the steering wheel vibrates. We've got seven speed dual clutch transmission. We've even got TV in there, guys. It's uh, you know, when we're driving, we're watching cartoons. In Dexter's lab in that. Yeah, look, rear blinds, like fully specced. Silverstone gray interior. We've got the M performance seats. I know there's gonna be things that I missed. Look, carbon fiber roof. Mad ting, sad ting. LCI. That's the motor. We're gonna go for a drive, POV style. Yeah, I don't know. The quality might be a bit dead, but you know it is, lads. Right, let's do this POV. Listen, if you want more content like this, all you gotta do is comment, throw a little like, and that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we're on this thing. We've even got 360 degree cameras. That's another thing I've not mentioned. There's gonna be loads of other things. Look, you see that we've got a full 180 of the front of the car. I did already say seven speed dual clutch. It's got interesting tune on it as well. It reacts really good. Adaptive suspension. We can change the steering feel. Creak a little window down. Oh, we're in park. Come on, it's been a while, lads. And uh, we also can change the gear shift speed so that we've got this little button here, which will select into its fastest settings because we need that instant. But look, see it kangarooing? Yeah, boy. You know what? Nice being back in the M3, boy. I'm just thinking, do we go hit the high street? Just, you know that, that victory lap? Oh man, she feels nice, the front end, honestly. I just come out my brethren's Quadrifoglio Alfa Romeo, and those cars, they are a bit better than the M3, but my God, this is still a very, very good car. I've not driven this much. Man, I just feel like a boss inside this vehicle right now. We've got all the extended leather. You see all the dashboard, it's all leather with stitching. Usually it's all like hard plastics, always plastic on the door cards. So she's saying they are sitting ducks. We could actually take a slay the whole house. That's nice. E36. Fair pays, bit of Nando. Right, that's the victory lap of the high street, lads. Yeah, I was saying to you that it's got an interesting map. So what happens is first and second gear, 
um, there's uh, there's nothing and then all of a sudden third gear it just hits you man yeah you've seen I've done M140 reaction videos like the Civic Type R's all of these cars they're all sick but you see the M3 it's the boss the king of them all man if you're inexperienced you can easily crash these but if you are a little bit handy behind the wheel uh, they're awesome man this is like a racing car for the road it's all about the handling uh, a lot of people jump in these cars from golf cars and front wheel drive cars quattros all wheel drive and uh, they don't like the m3s because there's a lot of feedback they you feel too much of what's going on some people want to jump in a car and just do their thing you know they don't want to feel like they're in a racing car they just want to cruise and but that's what this car is it's a driver's car man there's a lot of interaction a lot of feedback and it's very involving man and to extract its max performance you've got to fucking know what you're doing man if you go flat in second nothing nothing into third look way more power in third gear so we've definitely got some uh, boost by gear going on with this map man it's a really good tune it's first and second gear need the torque pulling back there is guys this car is gutless in second look nothing and then look as soon as you shift into third it's wheel spinning into third that's the scary thing about these dual clutches i've got it got the dampers in soft and you can feel the fact it's in soft because the body's moving around a bit misconception people think that your car needs to be stiff as f to handle better and put power down better but it's not true you need a bit of suspension travel we'll go sport yeah so that's not going to be the stiffest but oh, hey so like you feel it spin from the rear but the response the way it corrects itself um it's just a really well sort of car look at that wow the front end's beautiful beautiful that's fucking beautiful jesus m3 you know remember it's a handling car yeah it's not about doing 250 mile now listen off camera i've raised so many people like in my car back in the day i had a manual f80 and that thing i'm telling you like i could stay with anything bro anything nothing could get away with me and that man crazy how quick this is man i'm so used to driving cars with bigger turbos so you've got a way more lag but this is just nice and just instant like as soon as you press the throttle it's almost like we're na Bro, fuel is a madness right now and obviously guys just a quick reminder you can win literally this car for 11.99 i will be handing the car over to the winner it could be one of you watching right now like the winners are like people just like us that are winning it's no joke people are buying one ticket and they're winning these vehicles so yeah it's an awesome feeling handing these cars over by the way young guys just you know 20 30 40 grand up just like that you know the exhaust isn't too intrusive 